your time. This is Fox Kansas News at 9. Glad you're with us one hour earlier tonight. I'm Katie Tobby. The USDA is going after internet pet retailers who may be taking advantage of an animal law loophole. The agency is looking to put online sellers in the same oversight category as pet stores. Kevin Wheeler has a story tonight for some Fox. The internet is full of animal retail websites that sell pets to clients ready and willing to buy. But the USDA says that has become a problem and the agency is looking to make changes. People have ordered um, dogs either over the internet or through phone-based or mail-based companies and, um, you know, not all, but some of those uh, customers have received dogs that were ill, uh, that had uh, diseases and such like that. The USDA now wants to require online sellers to open their doors for buyers to see the animal or require them to obtain a license and be subject to site inspections. It's simply a way to include more animals under uh, the authority of the Animal Welfare Act to ensure that they're getting proper and humane care and treatment. Lila Lieben. Lori Hine is a licensed German Shepherd breeder and sells puppies online in addition to her physical location. Okay, this is our baby girl. She's forced. Although the laws would not change for her, she's doing exactly what the agency is proposing. If they're available to come out um, in driving distance, to come out and see our facilities, they're always welcome to come out. The Kansas Humane Society is welcoming the proposed changes, saying unregulated online sales can add to problems they already face. When you're ordering from the internet, you're just pushing click and you're done. And that's not fair to the animal and it's not fair to the animals in your community. Those in the animal community say it would be a perfect step towards cutting down on abuse and customers getting a bad apple. I think that this should breed up, bring everybody up to standards um, if they can enforce it. The rule would affect dog owners who breed more than four females and sell puppies online by mail or by phone. The USDA will take comments for 60 days before taking action. Kevin Wheeler, Fox Kansas News.